Message the committee sent with the initial rankings. Oh man, they they are looking at the eye test, right? With Ohio State, and obviously, I feel like Ohio State should be the number one team, but they don't deserve to be, and that's the difference. And they sent this committee set a precedent that they are going to look at teams for what they are. And Ohio State being undefeated obviously helped them in that regard. But right now, LSU has three top ten wins, so that should be the number one team in the country if you're basing it off of what teams have actually done so they set a precedent and i think they set themselves up for some issues to be wrong because they're supposed to be ranking off resume they're supposed to be ranking off looking at this team strength of schedule what they've done versus common opponents or stuff like that and when you put you you've said okay we're going to rank what you look like or we're going to value what you look like more than what you've done when you put penn state over clemson but not over Alabama, you are then saying, well, we're, we're, we think Alabama's better than Penn State just because we think they are rather than what they've done. And so on two accounts in the top five, they put teams at a certain ranking off of what they look like or what they think they are as a football team rather than what the resume speaks for. And that's going to create a lot of conversation moving forward in disagreement because it's not supposed to be that way. Right, and it's the initial ranking because let's be honest, by this time next week, like that's gonna be shaken up because we've got the number two and number three teams in the country facing each other, Alabama and LSU. I'll start with you. Who do you think's margin for error is slimmer between those two? Oh, Alabama's. Alabama has to win this football Why? game. Why? Well, because we, their strength of schedule is, is atrocious. Their only good win is Texas A&M, who's not a great football team this year. And then I, this, this there is value or it weighs on that the last time we saw Alabama on a football field with a team, they were playing a team that was equal talent-wise to theirs, they got dragged by Clemson in the national title game. And so that would be two straight games that we would watch Alabama on the field versus somebody that was equal talent-wise lose. So they have no room for error. And then the fact that they have the Iron Bowl, like LSU can, can have the value of their wins yeah. that they've already built up this season, Alabama has to win. LSU only has um, A&M and Arkansas left. So they are in great position. Here's the thing for me, though. Like, when you look at when you look at margin for error, it's really, like, I think Ohio State is getting in. I think w regardless of how this shakes out, Ohio State being ranked number one is going to get in. Think about it. You play a Even if they're a one-loss Big Ten. Well, well. LSU and Bama gonna play each other, right? And then you got LSU or Bama going play Georgia, in the SEC receivably in the right? SEC sure. championship. Ohio State loses to Penn State, they get another crack at it. Sure. So I, I just, I being number one, this ranking has come out based on how you look as opposed to what you've done. Ohio State may be that one loss team that gets benefit of the doubt. I, dude, if Ohio State loses to Penn State, it depends on what happens to it their happen game against Michigan. Like, if they beat Michigan in a, in a bet, like, if Ohio State loses to Penn State, it's going to be hard because people behind them are going to, like, what happens with Georgia? If Georgia goes and wins the SEC title. Thank you. If, L if LSU makes it to the SEC championship and barely loses to a Bama Georgia Bama. team, Georgia gets in. LSU Correct. could potentially get it. Bama you would choose Ohio, right? You choose Ohio State over a one loss LSU team who beat Alabama. I'm just telling y'all what happened already. Clemson just gonna sit back. Bama and just, let Bama just got in in the same scenario. They did. And we've seen, chilling. But we've also seen Ohio State win the Big Ten championship and not make it into the playoffs. If Ohio State loses the playoffs, they're not gonna get it. Uh, uh, L. My point exactly. There's so much more. I wouldn't do it again. There's so, there's so 